Scotty, um, how would you assess the day as a whole and what was working well for you out there? Um, I think it was really solid paying close attention. If you're the captain, what are the things you're thinking about kind of and how to evaluate just such a bunch? I mean, in my opinion, I think you want guys that um, can succeed in that environment, and that's a you know personality trait. I think you got, got there's certain guys that are, that are true winners out here, and um, I think – the trait that I'm looking for the most is maybe a little bit of golf course fit and then the guys that when you get in that environment playing an away game over there in Europe, um, you know, it's it's a bit different. And so I don't know how you can get in the mind of a few guys, but um, I feel like I got a decent idea of of who I'd want on the team and it's guys that are, that are mentally tough. And um, I shouldn't say winners by number of wins. It's just I think guys have that mentality, um, you know, because you could look at me two years ago being on that team. I think that was something that, a lot of captains would want is guys that are winners, and I hadn't won yet. But um, so I wouldn't. I, it's more of a mental thing than a, than a results thing. If that makes sense. With the cutoffs changing this year, going from 125 at the start of the playoffs to 70 and everything, and then with you guys um, getting into the eight signature events, if you get to the BMW Championship, does it feel? Does the end of the season? Did it feel more intense or more competitive, or did it feel just the same as any other? end of the season I think for certain guys I would say for sure I mean there's to get into that top 50 is huge and if you're sitting on the bubble of the 70 or even coming into the playoffs if you're like mid 30s I mean that's a pretty good season out here and then all of a sudden you're in danger of if you have two off weeks you can fall all the way out you know with how elevated the points are in the playoffs and so um you know it's it's definitely stressful for certain guys um I mean it's important to get into those events for next year I mean that's Big purses, best players in the world. Those are the tournaments you're, you're going to want to be playing in. And so there's definitely some some pressure for guys when it comes to the season or the end of the season. How impressive is it what Lucas Glover's done these last couple of weeks? Well, yeah, I mean, uh, I think he was pretty far outside of the playoffs to start Wyndham, if that's right. Um, yeah, 112. 112. So, yeah, he's, you know, um, pretty good ways out. And uh, yeah, to win that week and then to back it up the next week. I mean, winning out here takes a lot of energy to do and to be able to do it back-to-back weeks um you know with his season on the line is extremely impressive thanks Scotty. all right thanks